Tom Cooks? Oh man, just running my tail off on the backside, and uh, we talked about it earlier in the game, and just, I mean, it wasn't a great play as a defense, but we were able to get the ball out. What, so what happened to you after you? that one? I don't know. Uh, he said words, but I have no idea what he said, man. Oh man, he just kept smiling, and uh, he reminded me that this is for our aunt, man. She battled sickle cell for so many years, and and that was the inspiration behind our tackle sickle cell campaign. And uh, she went home in the beginning of January before our Charger game, and we went down to Orlando uh, to to finish that up and to say goodbye to her. And uh, she wasn't a football fan; she didn't care for football. But for her, it's been such a joy. We saw her in Miami for the last time. And uh, she just loves seeing us together. So I know she's up top with my dad smiling down and just as proud as can be. Is this is play last indicative at all of how you guys have played as a defense? Because obviously there was a breakdown somewhere, but you, you kind of picked each other up in that moment. Yeah, uh, Flo said it at the beginning of the playoffs, next play. Doesn't matter what goes on, there's going to be ups and downs in this game. Boyer told us uh, this week, Josh Boyer, our corners coach, no scoreboard watching. He reminded us of their Super Bowl in Atlanta uh, of just not watching the scoreboard, just fighting and fighting and fighting. And that's what we did tonight, man. We kept fighting as a defense this entire season through the ups and downs. Uh, throughout the course of this week uh, leading up to the Super Bowl, we had the headlines in our building of the Patriots dynasty is done. This defense isn't any good. Tom's too old. All of you said that, you were wrong. What happened?